Millennials, God bless you, you're just not tough. <laughs> I love you, but I could take your whole generation out with a jar of peanuts, <laughs> all right? Because... <laughs> Uh, it's just not tough. <laughs> we weren't allowed to have feelings. Uh, I remember once telling my father, I'm like, I'm cold. He was like, no, you're not. <laughs> okay, I guess I'm not. I don't know. <laughs> we would do things like, you would have nicknames based on your flaws. I have a brother, To Do To Do. <laughs> yeah, because he used to play with a toilet paper roll all the time. <laughs> You know, to do, to do, to do, to do, to do, to do, to do. We only let him play with that because he broke all our toys. Broke my Easy Bake Oven. You know what that is? Millennials, that's a little mini meth lab, is what that is. <laughs> like, it would explode, you'd get third degree burns. He broke our Stretch Armstrong. That was indestructible. <laughs> They showed the commercial, two trucks pulling it apart. That little to do to do broke it. And you know what came out of it? Ooze. Chernobyl, just slime. It was crazy. We had horrible toys back then. My son solved the Rubik's Cube. We had the Rubik's Cube, but I never solved it. Not for real. I did peel the stickers off and tell everybody. Sorry that I have to admit that now. Sorry, I just wanna. That generation grew up, you grew up with things to do. When you're in the car going somewhere, you're on your cell phones, your iPhones, you're playing on the iPad, you're watching DVDs. We had nothing in the back seat of the car, nothing. We used to make up games specifically to hit each other. <laughs> right? If a Volkswagen Beetle <laughs> passed your car and its headlight was out, someone was getting knocked out. <laughs> that, I mean, those were the rules. Tudu Tudu lost two teeth one summer. <laughs> and my father yelled at him, you should have paid attention. You should have paid attention. <laughs> Everything we did was about hitting each other. Remember a game called Two for Flinching? <laughs> See, if you were an only child, you missed out on this. This is where your brother or sister or bro whatever, whatever your siblings were, they all of a sudden developed ninja-like skills. They could hide on door jams, <laughs> right? They would, behind couches, they would jump out of nowhere. You'd just be walking along, and all of a sudden they would jump out and throw a punch at you and stop. Like just little, just like millimeters from your face. <laughs> And if you flinched, they'd punch you two more times. <laughs> two for flinching. You're like nine years old walking around like you have <laughs> Vietnam flashbacks. See, you young kids think you invented the twerk, but we've been, <laughs> we've been twerking for a long time. We just call it Twitch.